Welcome back to another YouTube video and today we will be performing our very own SEO heist. So for anybody that doesn't know what an SEO heist is, is essentially you are compiling a list of keywords that your competitors are already ranking for and essentially targeting the easier to win keywords on your own website. I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to reach out to low DR high traffic sites list. I don't know if any of you guys have seen his Twitter. However, what he does is he essentially tweets out every day or every other day websites with super low DR and super high traffic. So for example, his previous tweet was a website that has nine DR and it is ranking for over 2000 keywords and it's getting 15,000 traffic and it's valued at just under 10,000 traffic value. So for anybody that is trying to do this method, I highly suggest you guys check his Twitter account out. He actually does have a paid subscription. I believe it's 99 lifetime and you get access to the full Google Sheet where you can essentially see every single website that he comes across, whether it's a DR1 website or a DR2 website. But the good thing is, is that they have got a lot of high traffic. So this will be a public case study. So it, what I will be doing in this phase, is essentially collating a list of pages that I want on my website from one of the websites that I have got from this list. We will then be building that website out page by page and using our own methodology. Now, the good thing about the low R side of stuff is because I am very much a link builder, I've got my own link building agency, I will be able to build a stronger domain rating across the board. So in time, I will be able to beat out any competitors very, very easily by using this method. Now, if you guys want to check him out, you can obviously check out his Twitter. So if you want the paid list, you can obviously send him a message or just check out the link in the description down below. So this is what the free spreadsheet looks like, as you can see here, and it's getting 46,000 traffic. So you'll very easily be able able to rebuild this entire website very quickly and you won't even need that many links to outrank that existing website. So for anybody that is trying to perform the SEO heist, that is one strategy that you can go down. Now, if you are, for example, a local business and you're trying to do this, you can obviously compile a list of your competitors and rebuild a website based off of winning keywords that they are already doing. So with any further ado, let's actually get into the tutorial. This is one of the websites here on the actual list. It's a DR6. Well, Fitness Insider.com. It only has 136 referring domains, so on the grand scheme of things, it's not is ranking for an overall of 14,000 keywords, and it's getting about 14.3 thousand organic traffic every month, and it's valued at six and a half thousand traffic value overall. So this is the website that we will be using for our SEO heist. So this is the type of websites you will be able to find on the actual list, and they sometimes have super high traffic, even more than this. Sometimes they have medium traffic very much like this and sometimes they have a little bit lower however they are always super easy to rank for mainly because they don't actually do any link build. so the very first step is to actually find which pages that we need to do so I'm going to be using the site method so for anybody that doesn't know what is what we're going to do is go to forward slash sitemap and then go to the posts and we will then copy all of these URLs into a Google sheet the first step is to obviously copy all of the URLs in the sitemap now what you can do is use a Chrome extension called Clump and you will be able to just hold down on your keyboard and just copy all of the URLs in one go. Then what you want to do is head over to your Google Sheet and paste them into here. Then we're going to use a formula to get the H1 for every single page. So this is the formula that we're going to use. It is import XML and then A1 and then we've got forward slash forward slash H1 in speech marks. And if you just do that, it will go and grab the H1 for every single page so I'm gonna just do that for every single page and I'll be back in a second so now that we have all of our h1s what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna copy some of these and I'm gonna go over to auto blogging which will allow us to mass produce all of these articles in one go so this is auto blogging.ai what we're gonna do is click on dashboard and we will be presented by this screen once we've logged in I'm then gonna click on bulk generate and basically what you want to do is just paste in your article titles so once you've copied in all of your h1s you then want to essentially give this a project name one thing to bear in mind when you are doing this step there is a maximum limit of 50 articles per bulk generation so you might just need to do it in bulks 
of 50. Then you just give it a project name, choose the language and the length. I just set these to automatic and English U. Or if you are trying to rank in the UK, you can obviously set that to English UK as well. Then you can have this set to godlike mode if you want just a little bit more of the cert scanned and also NLP optimized as well. I recommend you do it just because it makes the article just that little bit better. Um, and then you can obviously add AI images as well. I typically tend to do that. And then you will be able to click bulk generate. Now, as I am recording this, this is temporarily disabled for the next 20 minutes. However, what I have done is I have pre bulk generated a load of articles yesterday. So I'm going to be using that. So once your articles have been generated, you just go over to the history tab. After your bulk generation has complete, this does take maybe five to 10 minutes to generate all 50 articles. However, just be patient. You will then want to just download CSV here. And then once we have downloaded the CSV, we're going to head over to our website. After logging into your website, what you want to do is download the auto blogging AI importer. And as you can see here, there it is installed. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you all the posts that I currently have on this. So we have got zero posts. Then what you want to do is go to the auto blogging importer, click on choose file, and you're going to obviously upload your CSV. So this is the CSV that we selected. We're going to click on post. So after you've selected your CSV, you can then select the categories that you want the posts to go into. So I'm just going to click on cups and then I'm going to click on import and this is going to literally take seconds. So I've just clicked import and within a few seconds, I will have a fully built out. So within a matter of minutes, I've just built out 24 articles on my website. So after you have finished generating all of your articles, you then want to essentially index all of these articles. Now I recommend these two tools, Index Me Now and also Omega Indexer. Both are really good. One thing I will say is that is a little bit more expensive, whereas Omega Indexer is a little bit cheaper, but both are really good indexing posts. Now the reason why we want to essentially index all of these posts is the fact that the quicker we can get these indexed, the quicker they're going to end up ranking. Now that is for the off-page SEO side of stuff and for the on-page SEO side of stuff, I will also be using Link Whisperer to do the internal linking. So that has been stage number one of the SEO heist. What I will also be doing is in a couple of weeks time, I'll be making an update video on how things are going with the website and what I have essentially started doing, whether that's featured images, whether that's link building, etc etc so remember to stay tuned and we will obviously continue this series as the website grows if you want a free 15 minute growth strategy with myself remember to check out casual-dash.com and fill in this form at the bottom of the website where you can book in for a call with myself